What's going on you sons of bitches? It is Sunday. And you know what that means? It's probably Monday by the time we upload this or Tuesday. Fuck knows when. But anyway, Monday. it is Monday? Well, there you go. Who knows and you've had a few too many, right? Anyway, so I, if you're like me, you don't give a fuck about what happened on Game of Thrones last night. I don't give a fuck about what house fell in love with what sparkly vampire. I'm not about any fucking wolves running around either. Huh? I saw the first season. I hate it. It was boring. Anyways, listen here you bastards. You fucking clan of fugazi fucks. You guys need to stop DMing us with stupid fucking questions like, Hey man, what color of laundry detergent did you use for your revocation long sleeve? I have the same one. I do. If you don't know how to use a fucking washing machine by this point, should you be on the internet? Do your parents know you're, you're online right now? Get some help, please. Anyways, we're here to discuss with you some more advice so you can stop DMing us unless it's questions about patch orders. We don't give a fuck. Time for Metalhead Advice Part 2, motherfucker. Alrighty, rule number one and probably the most important one. Grow out your fucking hair, bud. And if you don't do that, you need to grow out something. I don't care if it's your beard, I don't care if it's your toenails, just grow something out that's long and dirty. Ladies, you too. Lords of Chaos is hands down the worst fucking movie you've ever seen. Even if you liked it, it's the worst movie. And I'm sorry if you liked it, because there's nothing I can do to help you. Because people are going to call you a poser regardless. Fucking watching a movie produced by Vice, are you kidding me? Part 3, or as I like to call it, Part 2 and then Army of Darkness after. Go watch some fucking horror movies. Get some t-shirts of your favorite horror movies. And just live every day like it's a fucking horror movie. There's nothing fucking more rad in this world than watching some sicko getting hacked to bits by some immortal bastard wearing a goddamn hockey mask because he was late for his game. Fuck, bud. If I can't relate to that, no one else can. It's great. Live every day like it's goddamn fucking horror movie time. What if the patch apocalypse was yesterday? Would you have enough patches to sew on to every single one of your articles of clothing? You need to get evile back patches, fucking death metal patches, even more death metal back patches, some alcoholic thrash metal patches, along with some political thrash metal alcoholic patches, along with some more alcoholic metal patches, with some Canadian alcoholic metal patches, and finally, the greatest album of all time. Get yourself a copy of Bonded by Blood, because if you don't, I shouldn't have to say at this point. Next up, if you're a metalhead, you're going to be pounding brews all day. And you know what? It's not always that cool to be drinking by yourself. So you know what you have to do? Peer pressure all your goddamn friends to having beers with you. Find the, your closest buddy. Maybe the guy holding the camera. There you go, bud. <laughs> no problem. Now we have another alcoholic friend here. And it's a party. There you go. Party for two. If your merchandise doesn't take seven weeks to get to you, is it really authentic? If it doesn't look like it's been grabbed from underneath the pyramids of goddamn Giza in Egypt, it, it's not even authentic or real. And whatever you do, don't get another fucking Rye the Lightning shirt from Hot Topic or H&M. In fact, if I see you inside of an H&M or a Spencer's or a Hot Topic, I'm going to send you an invitation to become a permanent resident at the Mount Pleasant Cemetery, you fucking fugazi. You can make fun of literally anyone in Metallica, except for Cliff. Do not say one fucking bad word about Cliff, you son of a bitch. But you know who is okay to make fun of in Metallica? James, Lars, Kirk, Rob, Ron, Dave, other Dave, fucking Tabascus, fucking Jason, Rick Rubin, Lou Reed, all of them. Memes and one half. You can make fun of those guys, but don't you dare say anything. Next up, get ready to hate a band that you've loved for years all of a sudden just because you saw an article on Metal Injection that made you now think that that band is trash. That's it buddy, forget it, pack it up, send those Sabaton t-shirts back to Finland, it's over. Rip trivia. If you see someone else wearing a badass band t-shirt in public, that's it dude, you're bonded to them for life. You guys are bonded by blood. And you know what you need to do to introduce yourself? Grab your favorite brewski, grab your favorite Exodus CD, and go make a new friend. It can get out of the way, I want to give this to someone else, Jay Hoff. Excuse me, sorry. And last, but most certainly not least, buy a goddamn bullet belt. What the fuck is wrong with you? Get a badass one to put over your regular belt, because that's how belts work, apparently. And if you haven't collected enough bullet belts by now, congratulations. Your high school in America must have great security. That's all we've got for this week, folks. Tune in next week, where I'm going to show you 
What am I going to show them, Julian? That's it for this week. Thank you so much for watching. Click like if you really like this video. Click subscribe if you fucking loved it. And you chugged a beer while watching this video or ripped a bowl. We don't judge. We love everyone here that's watching our videos. And if you feel so inclined, hit up our merchandise website, www.jhoffilms.com. We got brand new patches. Three inches by three inches of blood rip and four by two inches and zero blaze it. Enjoy some dank fucking patches. Piss off your family. This one's 10 bucks. This one's 12 bucks. All prices are in Canadian. We ship worldwide and we only have a hundred of each. So get yours while supplies last. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Julian thinks my arms are like tree trunks. Can we verify this? Am I getting? Can you look at that. <laughs> like branches, man. What is Just that? explain to him this is what getting he shredded. Like Captain means. America post serum. Post serum. Inject that square into my veins, just like my beer. Are you using steroids? Unconfirmed. <laughs> Can you imagine? No, I'm pretty sure you are. <laughs>